We primarily study orthopedic or musculoskeletal injuries in our lab, and this grant and this overall project is primarily about anterior cruciate ligament injuries, or this is a ligament in your knee that provides your knee with stability, allows you to run, walk, and do any activity you like, and we're studying how your brain changes from those injuries. We used to treat these injuries as primarily musculoskeletal problems that require just recovery of muscle strength and range of motion. We now know over the last few years, thanks to some breakthroughs with neuroimaging techniques, that the brain fundamentally changes how it generates that motion. Normally we use a sense called proprioception, and this is the knowledge of where your joints are in space without seeing them. And we find that that sense is damaged after the injury and your brain starts to use vision for motion. Our study is trying to better quantify how those brain changes happen over therapy and design new targeted interventions to be done in the clinic to help these patients recover more fully. One of the, our first tools were these stroboscopic glasses that essentially you wear and they allow us to dictate the level of visual feedback patients receive. The other tool we use a lot is virtual reality. We are limited a lot in our sports medicine clinics or even in hospitals to give patients the sort of demands they'll have when they return to the real world or return to sport. So virtual reality allows us to really challenge the brain's visual, proprioceptive, and thinking systems to more simulate the demands they'll have on the field.